They might be in a weird situation where for some reason your Apple Watch is not showing any photos. So maybe every time you're coming in here, it just keeps saying no photos sometimes. Now, the main reason why this may be happening is because a majority of the time, you may be actually seeing that within your Photos app of your iPhone, they may not be syncing up properly with your specific device. So the first thing you want to want to do is you want to make your way over to your iPhone and you want to make your way over to their Apple Watch application. So go and come into the Apple Watch application. And what you're going to want to do here is you want to scroll until you see Photos. So right here, you will see the Photos little option right here. What you're going to want to do is you want to go and tap on Photos and then all these things are going to come up. Now, you're going to want to keep a close eye on these things. Under photo syncing, right here where it'll say automatically add photos to your Apple Watch from your iPhone, that doesn't necessarily mean all the iPhone photos are going to be synced over. So what you're going to want to do when you scroll down, you want to go ahead and click on sync memories or sync featured photos. But right here under sync album, you want to click here and you want to choose the album that you want to go ahead and sync. So in this case, if I want to go ahead and sync this specific album, the favorite, but also with photos limits, if you want to go ahead and change that photo limit, click on here and go and change this limit to another limit. So change it to 250 photos or 500 photos. Those are some other things you're going to have to keep in mind as well. And once you do those things, that will probably end up fixing the problem. And that may be all you're going to have to do there. Now, if that's still not working, what you also want to do is make sure that within your Apple Watch, you are synced up properly to your iPhone, that you're updated on your Apple Watch, that your iPhone is updated. Things like that can also cause some weird issues. You may also want to try resyncing your Apple Watch to your iPhone as well. That's another thing you can try doing. But for the most part, those are pretty much the main ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.